to your point, if you want this to be an open avenue for immigrants to come and, and get jobs for talented immigrants, would you like it to be a certain number in terms of how many H-1B visas should be issued each year, or would you just like it to be open? I would like it to be open, and I think talk like that is uninformed, paranoid xenophobia of, of people who don't have real access to what goes on in the world, and they're just afraid. Um, but, you know, it's some, another funny discussion about yesterday. Human beings somehow want to, once they're in the warm room, they want to lock the door and not let anybody else in, which is completely bizarre, because the only way to get great um, productivity, excitement, new ideas, is to open the door wide open and let everybody flow in and out. And, and if we don't find a way of doing that, this country is lost. We're not going to be able to compete with the other countries if we don't find a real immigration standard that's going to work. What would you say is the most pressing need when it comes to workforce in the technology industry here in Silicon Valley? Well, I think that we need to release people's rights to be able to work here. Because I think, I mean, I think it's extra strange because we're the country where if you go to China, I've lived in China, I've lived in many European countries, I speak seven European languages, you can't become a German, you can't become a Chinese person, but you can become an American. And, and that's just an amazing, beautiful thing that we're about to give up on. And it's just stunning to me that we're willing to do that. And it, the people that come here, they want to be more American than anybody else, I think. And they're so proud to be Americans once they become Americans. And the workload that they're willing to put in and the accountability and how they show up as citizens in this country. And, you know, I think we, we need to open our spectrum completely and think about certainly where I live. Maybe we live in a very rich area, so it's, I'm, I'm very open to accept that this is not a normal uh, place. But... Uh, certainly up and down the West Coast, people trust their childcare with immigrants that are often not legal. They trust uh, their house that they're going to build with all this money they made with immigrants uh, building it. They trust uh, the food they eat uh, in the front and the back office of, of the restaurant. And uh, they trust their beautiful gardens with immigrants. And yet we have this idea that they don't belong here. It's, it's so grotesque, I can't even believe the conversation.